So sometime in probably 2008 or 9, I was in prison and I had a one-man cell. I'm lucky I had a one-man cell because the rest were two-man cells and they'd lock you in a room with two men and usually if they were a murderer or something like that, it's not really, you know, not fun to get locked in a room overnight with a murderer every night, you know. So I had this single cell and it was meant for handicapped people. And I had a friend, well I thought he was my friend, and we were playing Pinochle. And we were sitting on my bed, and out of nowhere, a large man came into my cell. And all I seen was the dude that was in front of me that I thought was my friend. I seen him run, run off. And the next thing I know, I'm getting hit in the side of the head with a fist. And I got hit like maybe once and I turned. And when I turned, I came back like when, I was, when you're a little kid and you lay on your back and you kick your brother in the face. Well, that's what I had to do to this guy. And I leaned back on the bunk, I kicked, turned around, and I, I, he just like started yelling. I don't know what the hell he was yelling either. I just remember leaning back and I just pretended it was my brother and I just fucking hit him with the heel right in the chin and it kind of stunned him. And then. He was like taken aback, but he was looked like he wanted to hit me. And I just remember yelling, why are you hitting me? <laughs> like, why are you attacking me? Like, or whatnot, you know? And he was looking at the heel of my foot. At that same time, I'm yelling that this old man came into the cell and he's like, he's like, leave that white boy alone. He don't do nothing but read Harry Potter books and play chess. Leave him alone. And he came and drug him out of the room. And, uh, I was like, oh, thanks, man. Like, I appreciate it. And his name was Foster Brown. And uh, Foster Brown is a real person. This is him. So a special shout out to Foster Brown. Because if it wasn't for you, I probably wouldn't be here. Because that guy was going to kill me.